Hi, welcome to DailyNet. The first news in this video is about Sean Shao and Sabrina Zhuang, who have officially collaborated in the film The Legend of the Condor Heroes. The film The Legend of the Condor Heroes The Great Hero officially unveiled a poster a few days ago, revealing Sean and Sabrina as the major characters. Chue Hark, whose unconstrained style and design in numerous films has won him the nickname Old Monster Shu among moviegoers, will direct the film. As a representative of the new age of Hong Kong cinema, his remake of The Legend of the Condor Heroes will undoubtedly feature new attempts and innovations, bringing new surprises and various visual experiences to audiences. Martial arts fans consider the 1983 version of The Legend of the Condor Heroes to be a classic. Chue Hark chose popular artists Sean and Sabrina to play Guo Jing and Huang Rong this time. Can Chue Hark create another myth and classic? The answer is most likely yes. Guo Jing, who was played by Huang Riwa in the 1983 version, will be played by Sean Shao. Chue Hark hand-picked him, and his image as a lovely man dressed in an ancient costume was deeply ingrained in people's hearts. Chue Hark, of course, had a keen eye for casting. Since his first appearance in a TV series, he has been mostly costume dramas. He rose to prominence with his portrayal of Wei Wuxian in the costume fairy tale drama The Untamed, as well as the dramas Duluo Continent and The Wolf, and has amassed a large fan base on Weibo, with over 20 million followers. Sabrina Zhuang, on the other hand, will play Huang Rong, who was played by Wang Meiling in the 1983 version. She previously acted in the hit fantasy costume Love Drama Mountains and Ocean as Zia Ruining, and she won Asia's Best Newcomer Award at the 24th Busan International Film Festival. She recently demonstrated her abilities in the drama Miss Chun is a Litigator and adopted a pure feminine style. Sabrina is skilled at understanding characters by tiny eye movements and circumstances, and she can be exact in eliciting the emotional resonance of the audience. Next, reports of Yang Yang and Wang Chiran dating are resurfacing. The Chinese top actor Yang Yang and Wang Chiran can't disguise their feelings for each other. Since they were filming the new drama My Fireworks on Earth, these two completely improvised the drama. Despite being seen by paparazzi cameras several times, the two have yet to confirm the claims. Recently, prominent Chinese paparazzi Li Chui openly uploaded a video in which he stated that Wang Chiran met Yang Yang at the hotel for three days in a row. Wang Chiran went straight to the hotel after work on April 22nd at 11 p.m., whereas Yang Yang did not appear and requested his assistant to wait for him in the parking lot. Yang Yang went out with his assistant on April 25th and purposefully picked a different way than Wang Chiran. Yang Yang and Wang Chiran are said to have fallen in love after appearing in the drama My Fireworks on Earth together. It's not the first time they've been rumored to be dating. Previously, several reports claimed that they were seen kissing on the beach while vacationing together. A photo of a couple skiing is also circulating, and it is highly thought that they are Yang Yang and Wang Chiran. And now they've been photographed spending the night together in a hotel. Netizens on the other side claimed that they were not surprised and asked them to publicly proclaim their relationship without hiding it. Then there's Rosie Zhao, who became viral after the trailer for the drama Hidden Love was released. Hidden Love, a romance drama starring Rosie and Chen Ziyuan, has become the subject of many netizens ahead of its debut. When a new trailer was released, it received over 12.1 million views in one day, and 1.7 million netizens added it to their watchlist. This drama, based on the novel of the same name, follows Song Ji, played by Rosie, who is secretly in love with her older brother's friend Duan Jashu, played by Chen Ziyuan. When Duan Jashu graduated from college, the two became estranged owing to a misunderstanding. It wasn't until Song Ji graduated that she learned about Duan Jashu's personal troubles and grew closer to him. Rosie takes on the role of a young girl experiencing her first love in the drama. She is seen in the teaser gushing from her crush as she writes a name on a piece of paper. Fans were amazed by the actress' ability to represent the youthful character's purity and recounted scenes reminiscent of their high school relationship. The actress may also be heard speaking in a sweet tone, despite the fact that Rosie's typical voice is loud and direct. Netizens complimented Rosie for perfectly capturing the character's personality in terms of appearance, voice, and facial emotions in just 36 seconds of the teaser. Many fans write things like, I really like her voice. Rosie changed voice just for the role. She is perfect for the role and I am looking forward to the drama. Meanwhile, Hidden Love is set to be released later this year. We'll move on to the next piece of news. Earlier this year, Chinese star Arthur Chen was embroiled in an intimate photo leak incident. 
When a bed photo of him with influencer Yi Lin went viral, it sparked bad headlines and criticism because the woman in the photo was discovered to be married. Unlike many other artists who had their performances canceled due to scandals, Arthur was given a second opportunity when he emphasized that the shot was taken while the two were still single. Many believe this is due to his privileged background as the son of a famous filmmaker Chen Kaiga. As a result, the film he starred in, Yesterday Once More, was approved for release and premiered earlier this month. The film also starred Zhou Ye, and its box office gross only exceeded 20 million yuan after three days of distribution. Not only that, but the film was accused of plagiarizing the 2004 film If Only, which starred Jennifer Love Hewitt and Paul Nichols. In response to plagiarism allegations, the agency issued an official statement in which it stated, The film tells the love story of the male and female protagonists crossing through space and time, traveling both forward and backward in time to find one another. The characters and setting of the film are all original developments. The film's expectations were high, as Arthur and Zhou Ye were poised to become the next IT couple. However, because of his issue, fans have noticed that Zhou Ye appears to have stayed away from him during promotions. Our news for the day will conclude with the confirmation of the Joy of Life Season 2 cast. After months of anticipation, the historical drama Joy of Life Season 2 has finally confirmed its cast and begun filming. The majority of the first season's cast has been confirmed to return for the second season. However, there were previously many reports that Sweet Lee and Sean Xiao would not be appearing in the second season. This rumor elicited both positive and negative responses from netizens, because both of them are already associated with the characters they play. It is thought that if the actor is replaced, the image would change afterwards. The rumors, however, are not wholly accurate or incorrect, as the female protagonist, Sweet Lee, has been confirmed to return for the second season. What about Sean, though? Sean Xiao, who played the character Yan Bingyun in the first season, does not appear to be returning for the second season. Previously, it was reported that various actors, including Wang Yushuo, Liu Shuei, and Ray Chong, would take his position. However, a recent search on the My Drama List portal revealed that there is no character named Yan Bingyun for the second season of Joy of Life. It is still unclear whether or not the character will be deleted. Meanwhile, the drama will pick up where it left off in the first season, following Fanchian as he takes control of the palace stronghold and eventually overthrows Emperor Liu Yu. Stay tuned for more information. Thank you for watching, please leave your thoughts in the comments section and see you in the next video.